Hey guys, welcome back to my channel over to the Philippines. <clears throat> uh, we just met up with, uh, with Jamie at uh, this coffee, the coffee and bean and tea leaf shop here at the G Mall. Huh? You wanna buy some stuff? <laughs> Yeah, we met up with him, uh, him and his uh, his girlfriend. Uh, Jamie has a YouTube channel. I'm Judy. It's called uh, Off the Cuff, Off the Cuff Adventures with Jamie. <laughs> there he is, right there. Uh, you get some uh, eyeglasses. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't feel like interviewing or anything like that. Sometimes you just want to sit and relax and have good old conversations, you know? I just didn't feel like interviewing him. <coughs> I, know, I know it's something I got to get used to, but, you know, right now I'm just, I'm just not into the whole interviewing thing with people right now. I'm just getting used to talking on my my camera. <laughs> I mean, I know I'll eventually I'll be uh, interviewing people eventually, but yeah, I just don't want to do that right now. Yeah. But uh, <clears throat> but yeah, guys, uh, check out his channel. Um, it's called Off the Cuff Adventures with Jamie. Um, and uh, yeah, check out his channel, guys. And uh, I'll, I'll be meeting up him. Uh, we'll meet up with him and his girl at some point in the future. Oh, she's starting to get away from me here. <laughs> Over here at the grocery store here. What's the name of this grocery store? G-Mall. G-Mall? G-Mall grocery store. G-Mall grocery store. G-Mall. <laughs> G-Mall, this one. Okay. G-Mall grocery store. Some are delicacies. Okay. Dorian. Dorian Park. Okay, okay. 59. 59 pesos. You can get it if you want, baby. No. No. So you're going to be complaining about the prices. Yeah, you, if you guys, uh, you know, want American name brands, I mean, they have it. Like, here's Skippy Peanut Butter. Yeah, yeah see, the, see the difference in prices, guys? That's 195 pesos. That's about $4. If you see the local brands, here's 64 pesos. So you see the difference. There's one for 54 or so. You know, it kind of depends. Do you want American brands or you want local brands? You know, it's better to go with local brands because otherwise you're going to pay up the ass. You know, if you want to live your American lifestyle here. But, uh, I mean, I don't know about you guys, but, you know, I kind of like to leave the American lifestyle back in America. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, I'm going to kind of walk up through here. And if I see any other American type brands, you know. I'll pull it out to you guys. <clears throat> I'm not sure what all she's planning on buying here, but <clears throat> she's buying groceries for our house, guys. Because <laughs> we're getting ready to go to the house. Once we leave here, we got to stop by our sister Jones place and get the rest of my luggage and the rest of her stuff. See there guys, there's Welch's Welch's orange juice. That's uh almost eight dollars. Eight bucks guys for that. Jesus. Mm. No. 
that's expensive but like i said that's american that's american brand so you want to go all american you're gonna pay it you're gonna pay for it <laughs> Um, okay, Vienna sausages. Six ninety nine. I would say seven seven hundred pesos. You know, that's like I don't know how many you get. Um, five ounce. Is that like a, for a box? Let's see, I don't know how many that is. Forty-five pesos. That's you know forty-five cents basically. Fourteen dollars for whatever this is advertising. <clears throat> Four, I mean fourteen dollars. That must be like I don't know how many you get. Again, I mean it's so expensive, guys. Oh shit. <laughs> I forgot these carts. They're kind of weird. Let's see how this cart is. You wanna, oh, look at here. You go this way with it. Oh, it goes in all four directions. <laughs> the cart, the wheels, they kind of go in all directions. <laughs> There's some more Nestle Nest Cafe. <clears throat> some more American brands, guys. I mean, like I said, if you guys want to pay the higher prices, I mean, they got American stuff. There, there's Duncan Hines. 179 pesos. That's almost $4. Um, Four bucks for a box of uh, you know for a cake mix. I mean that seems a little expensive, but you know there's some lots orange juice. Uh, got some dish detergent. <clears throat> this, um, I don't know. I don't think I don't think you're gonna find the uh, palm olive or you know Dial or any of those kind of brands over here. I mean, I, I don't. You never know. You might. <clears throat> oh, here's Downey. Got some downing detergent. Looks like downing's pretty popular. We got lots of downing, lots of choices. Mm -hmm. <coughs> uh, what else we got here? Uh, Arm and Hammer, baking soda. <coughs> <clears throat> oh, there's palm olive. You got tired. Okay, go ahead. Yeah. If you guys want your uh, American products, like it's here. What else we got? He's getting some Pantene. You got your Pantene, baby? <laughs> she, <laughs> she is so silly. <laughs> Hi there. How are you? I'm doing a vlog. Yeah, I'm doing a vlog for my YouTube channel. Right. It's called uh, Road to the Philippines. Wow. Are we subscribed? Huh? Name of my channel? Uh, Road to the Philippines. 
road to the Philippines. Yeah, road to the Philippines. That's it. <laughs> I have also mine. Oh yeah? What's, yeah. what's the name of your channel? Rojilin. It's like this. She's showing me her, uh, she's got a yeah, YouTube I, channel. I, I, will just, I will just comment one of your videos. And you okay, it's all right. Like <laughs> Rogeline Pellet's vlog. Okay. Yeah, when I post it, you'll, uh, put your comment on it. Tell me that you met me here. <laughs> that way yeah. I'll, I'll subscribe to your channel. Yeah, thank you. Okay. <laughs> all right, thank you. Oh, mon have I gotten monetized? Yeah. No, not yet. Why? I don't have enough subscribers yet. How many? Um, I got like 615. Almost. So, um, I'm gonna have a... Right. I'm getting close. <laughs> Just more 400. <laughs> How many do you have? Nice, nice. Yeah. That's awesome. I've already monetized, but I need to reach the one hundred dollars. Oh, okay. <laughs> cool. All right. Well, I wish you luck on your channel. Yeah. I'll check it out. Okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> she has her uh, YouTube channel. <laughs> Just kind of walking around all over the place. <laughs> yeah, uh, she's over there somewhere. <laughs> uh, yeah, Irene just kind of takes off and I, I can't find her. <laughs> she's so, oh, there she is. There she is. <laughs> Yeah, that's pretty interesting how you run into people, you know. Uh, yeah, she has her own YouTube channel. She has like over 1300, I think she said 13K. Mm -hmm. Huh? All right, take care. <laughs> uh, got some other brands here, Lysol. Moisturizer. Hmm. Okay, that's cool. Oh, look at that. Kingsford. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Kingsford. Hell yeah. Now we're talking. Alright, guys. Here's a... I'm not sure how big this bag is. Oh, 16 pounds. Uh, for... Well, that's almost, oh, uh, wow, wow, guys, 1,099 pesos, <laughs> almost 11,000 pesos, that dude, guys, that's $22, $22, $22, for a bag of Kingsford charcoal, holy moly, that's crazy, $22, my God. I mean, I haven't grilled out in a while, but I don't remember paying $22 for a bag of charcoal. Holy smokes. Hey, Irene. Let's go. Show some of the neat products through here. This is the meat pile, guys. Oh, 
pork chops, 325. That's about $6.50 a pound. Man, that's not, I don't really don't know what the price is of meats. Three sixty-five, three hundred sixty-five pesos a pound. I guess it's a pound. Hello. Uh, chicken breast, two hundred seventy pesos. That's uh, five dollars and forty cents a pound. Pesos a pound. That's eight dollars and twenty cents. Eight dollars and twenty cents a pound, guys. My goodness gracious. Stuff's expensive, guys. I mean, this whole inflation is a uh, you know it's it's everywhere. You know, it's affected everybody. Yeah, that's outrageous. Keep saying a pound. These are kilograms. Oh, jeez. My bad, guys. Yes. All the stuff that I was saying was per pound. It's per kilogram. Okay. All right. That that that. that okay. That makes a huge difference, guys. <laughs> so all those prices I just mentioned per pound. Just divide that by 2.2. That'll give you the kilograms. Okay, yeah, you know, it's not as expensive as I thought now. Beef? Oh, check this out. Beef kneecaps. Okay. That's, that's, that's a new one. I haven't... Huh. Beef kneecap. Okay. Beef feet. You guys want some beef feet? Oh, oh wow. Don't think that I wouldn't try it. I'm telling you, I, I, I would love to try new stuff like that. <laughs> yeah. Beef buffalo shank, beef chuck ribs. Oh. 
That seems expensive. $28 or 28 pesos for a bag of mozzarella. Wow. That's expensive. You can see why there's, you know, a lot of people don't drink a lot of milk. My God. I mean, seriously, how can people afford to buy milk? That's unbelievable. <laughs> wow, four dollars and sixty cents for a liter. It's over sixteen dollars. Oh my God. A gallon of milk, guys. So if I want, you know, I eat, you know, <laughs> before I go to work every day, I always have a small bowl of cereal. <laughs> How are you guys? <laughs> Checking out your grocery store. I'm very good at You guys will be on my YouTube channel. Yeah. <laughs> wow, baby. I didn't realize how expensive milk is. Why is milk? Milk is so expensive. Huh? You see the price of milk? Outrageous. <laughs> Picked up some uh, eggs. Eggs. What's how many pesos are those? Huh? I'm just curious. Six seventy-five each. Uh, six. Each. For each uh, egg. Large size. For each, each individual. Mm -hmm. Each individual egg. Yeah, individual. Oh wow. <laughs> Six seventy-five each. So that's uh twelve cents, guys. Twelve cents per egg. Twelve cents an egg. Uh, that's about a dollar. Dollar. Dollar forty-four. Dollar forty-four cents. No, dollar forty-four cents for a dozen. Oh, the Here's the soda, guys. And uh, for those of you that, you know, want to have your Pepsi, uh, 
69 pesos for the oh, how big is it? Hmm. I mean, I'm assuming it's a liter. That's like one liter. Yeah, you see a lot of uh, a lot of milk is sold, you know, that way. It's kind of. I mean, you don't see a lot of this, you know, milk package this way. Uh, 127 pesos. Two dollars and thirty cents. Two dollars and thirty cents for a box. Yeah, be thankful, guys, for that. But, uh, if you're a milk drinker, you're going to be paying a lot to have milk over here. <coughs> Which, you know, I mean, it makes sense, though. I mean, uh, you know, just based on the height of the average Filipino, Filipino, you know, if the, the cost of milk is outrageous. <laughs> yeah, you figure the cost of milk is, you know, so high. Um, yeah. People aren't going to be going and buying a lot of milk. And without milk, you need milk to make them bones grow, right? So, it makes sense why population on average is you know at a certain height much shorter than the average height like in the United States you know one of the last things people want to do is buy milk for their family I mean that makes sense That's uh, four dollars. What is this? Oh, that's grape juice, baby. It's not. That's not alcohol. Yeah, it's alcohol. Yeah, that's not alcohol. Why you want some? You want some, baby? You, you want to? You want to celebrate? Stop. Uh, that's that's been in our house for the first time. <laughs> oh, 
you want alcohol free, sure. I mean, you can, if you want to buy that for the kids. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go buy that for the kids. That'd be cool. Uh, for us? For us? Uh, for us? Yeah, these are all. These are all. These are all alcohol free. These aren't. None of these are have alcohol. In them. Huh? This all juice, baby. Sorry. Yeah, this is not. There's no. I'll grab the cart, baby. She want to have a little celebration for when we get to our house. Maybe. Man, driving this cart is kind of like driving a car. Are you getting, uh, where's the, where do they sell the wine at, baby? Huh? Crunch and munch, huh? Mm. Crunch and munch. <laughs> no, baby, I don't. I don't eat. I don't eat hardly any junk food. Okay. I mean, I, I know I look like. Ooh. Oh, I do eat this though. Chicken of the sea. Ninety pesos. Oh my, 90 pesos, that's a dollar. Oh man, it's a dollar and 80 cents a can. Wow, wow, okay. Maybe I won't be eating tuna. Dollar <laughs> 80 cents a can of tuna, chicken of the sea, baby. Oh my lord. Chicken of the sea, a little expensive. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, 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 what do we got here? She, she wants a little bit of something for celebrate, you know, us finally being together in our house. Oh, so Mm. Mm. For you. If I have any any guy, any viewers that drink alcohol, you know, this would kind of give me an idea. There's 70, 70 milliliters of gin for two, 215 pesos. That's, Four dollars and thirty cents goes. I mean, that's. I don't think that's bad. I mean, I don't know. I don't drink. I don't. I really drink. So. Uh, Margarita Queen. Hmm. Uh, there's some, some sort of margarita. Silver was a guave. Four dollars and sixteen cents. <clears throat> you guys want to know how to do the conversion rate from uh, pesos to U.S. dollar? You just move that decimal point over two spots, and then you multiply that times two. So move it over, multiply by two. Four dollars and sixteen cents, right? Yeah, it took, it took me a while to get, you know, my brain isn't very good sometimes. My brain sucks, man. 
Oh yeah, oh, there's the famous red horse. Oh, look at the red horse. <laughs> oh yeah, let me see, red horse. Red horse. Uh, red horse. There you see it, guys. 6.9% alcohol content. Um, I don't know if this is the price of it. With that, I don't see one. I see the smear off. That's 41 pesos. 82 cents, guys. 82 cents. Hmm. What'd you find, baby? You found some wine? Hmm. Hmm. Wow. Look at that absolute. Check this out, guys. <laughs> absolute peach absolute uh, 1134 pesos that's $22.68 22 dollars for that yeah. absolute vanilla a little less than $10 for that I mean, I don't think it's, I mean, you guys have to tell me, comment in the comment sections if that's reasonable price. I think it's reasonable. I don't think it's that bad. Uh, coffee brandy. There, 117 pesos. It's a dollar and 34 cents, guys. Two dollars and 34 cents, my bad. $2.34. Um, martini. Mm, what do they got? Martini and Rossi. Oh, that would be amazing if they got Martini and Rossi. Ah, here we go. Huh? Jim Beam. Uh, Jim Beam, 750 milliliters, 676, that's a little over $13 for a bottle, a little over $13, guys. Um, I really wish I could find that Martini and Rossi, I love that stuff. Hmm. go back and uh, check out how well I videotaped this I may have to uh, do it a little bit different because I may be walking around too fast for the camera to adjust you know what I'm saying there's some red wine uh, 255 pesos It's a little over five dollars, guys, for a bottle. I mean, that's reasonable, right? Uh, what else we got? Ah, oh, man. I was really hoping. I don't drink a lot of wine, guys, so. Sam. What kind of wine did you get, baby? Huh? I don't know what that is, but... Hmm. Hmm? I don't know, I'm just looking at... I have no idea what these are. Right. Well, I'm gonna get another one. Different. What's this? Sangria? Almost okay. Try that. 10%. Huh? 10%. Okay. <laughs> you want to try it? 
<laughs> wow, look at that. Look at that thing. Look at the size of that thing. Oh my god, 9650. <laughs> Holy moly. Oh my god. Check that out, guys. <laughs> huh? Hey, uh, yeah. Expensive. 10,000 pesos, guys. Huh. That's, that's over $200. Over $200, USD. <laughs> Holy moly. This. Hey, baby. Wow, this is where they... This is where they keep all the good stuff back here, guys. Huh. Huh. Okay. Hey, here's here's all the baby formula, guys. Man, there's a, a shortage there in the United States. Look at all look at all the infamil, guys. Infamil, look at that. Yeah, there's no shortage over here, guys. I mean, it's sad. It's sad there's a huge shortage there in the United States. So look at this, guys. Yeah, there's no shortage here. Look at this Pediasure. Check it out, guys. Insure. Grandpa's Insure, Insure Gold. <clears throat> yeah, there's no shortage of uh, infant formula here, guys. That's all formula. Similar. Lots of American uh, American brands. Hmm. Wow. I'm sorry. I feel sorry for the you know for you guys in America, man. Jeez, that, that's. That's crazy, man. Hopefully they'll get that shit taken care of. But, uh... <clears throat> All right, baby. You ready to check out? Mm -hmm. Looks like we got a full cart. <laughs> <laughs> you got it, baby? <laughs> There's another thing of uh, Similac. Yeah, that's crazy. There's such a shortage of formula there in the United States. I mean, they're, yeah, they're, it's everywhere here. <coughs> Frosted Flakes. You guys want Frosted Flakes? Two eighty nine. Oh, excuse me, sir. About six dollars a box. I mean, this is a huge store, baby. <laughs> oh, dang! She just ran over that lady's uh, groceries. <laughs> Nothing, baby. Yeah, she just ran over that lady's groceries there. That's funny. Uh, there's some more formula, guys. Yeah, that's crazy. You know, I know that, that one plant there in the U.S. got shut down. Uh, for whatever reason, I don't, I don't watch the news anymore, what's going on in the U.S. It's too depressing. Spend most of my time, you know, watching YouTube videos of guys over here in the Philippines. So, yeah. But yeah, this is a huge store. Huge store. I mean, this is kind of like a high V or, you know, a large high V or a large um, price chopper back in the U.S.
But I'm gonna go ahead and Dang, I've been on here for 45 minutes, guys. <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this video, cut this video off. Um, if you like these kind of videos, guys, you know, um, personally, I haven't seen videos of people walking around grocery stores, looking at prices to give you an idea how much it'll cost for certain items. Um, if you like this kind of video, give me, a, give it a thumbs up. Um, if you don't like it, tell me what, what you don't like about it uh, in the comments section. And as always, you know, thank you guys for watching and tuning in. Keep watching my crazy videos. Um, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. <laughs> hey, baby. <laughs> and um, share my videos. Smash that bell icon so you'll get notifications on, on my new videos that I upload. I'm trying to put out at least one video a day, which is a lot for me. Uh, normally I put out one a week, one every two weeks sometimes. So this is kind of a treat for me to put out a video, you know, one video a day. But yeah, if you like this video, um, let me know. And, uh, Appreciate you guys for for uh, continuing to follow me on my journey on the road to the Philippines. Have a wonderful and blessed day, guys. Peace out.